many Valorant players have found that the game appears to use a lot of memory or CPU when running on their Windows PC. If you're having the same issue and don't know what to do, this video should assist. Although I can guarantee that Valorant functions correctly in both full screen and window mode. Some users were able to resolve the high CPU usage issue by playing the game in full screen mode exclusively. If you haven't used this approach yet, follow these steps. Run Valorant on your keyboard. Press Alt plus Enter keys at the same time. Check the CPU consumption in the task manager. If playing Valorant in full screen mode does not work, the next step is to close and restart Valorant. When doing so, remember to restart the Riot client before launching them to close both the Valorant program and the Riot client. Open Task Manager. Locate the processes for each and click the End Task button. Even if the Valorant game is operating smoothly, it is critical to keep it up to date. Temporary or small issues may develop from time to time and they may only be resolved by applying updates. Although the game will not run if it is out of date, you should check for updates manually if you haven't played it in a while. Some individuals may find it difficult to update the Valorant game, especially if there is a problem with the Riot Vanguard client. When playing on a Windows PC, you should also upgrade your graphics card drivers. Outdated graphics card drivers can cause a variety of problems including unpredictable crashes, game failures, and, in our case, excessive CPU utilization. If you're a dedicated player and you're experiencing excessive CPU use while playing Valorant, one of the most basic things you can do is make sure your graphics card drivers are up to date. The Valorant high memory issue that some users are encountering may be caused by a Windows Defender scheduled scan. In other words, while Valorant is operating, your built-in Windows antivirus program may be checking your disks for hazards. If you're experiencing Valorant high CPU consumption at the same time every day or at regular intervals, check Windows Defender's scheduled scan and adjust it so it doesn't interfere with Valorant. High Precision Event Timer, or HPET, is a hardware timer in your computer that, if not operating properly, can influence system performance and create gaming troubles. If you're still experiencing the Valorant high CPU utilization issue, you may try disabling it. Here's how you do it. On your keyboard, press the Windows button plus R to open the Run dialog box in the Run command box. Type dev and gmt.msc and click OK. Once the device manager is open, expand system devices. Find high precision event timer and right click on it. Select disable device. Reboot your PC and check if you're still having Valorant high CPU consumption issue. Another option at this point is to test your Valorant game when the PC is in clean boot mode. A clean boot will start Windows with only the essential drivers and apps, which can help determine whether the problem is due to software or a conflict with another app somewhere. You must accomplish the following. Hold the Windows key and press R. Type msconfig and click OK in the Run dialog box. Choose the Services tab. Then put a check on Hide All Microsoft Services and select Disable All. Choose Startup and select Open Task Manager. At the last field called Startup Impact, disable all the ones with high impact. Reboot your system and it will start up in the clean boot mode. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.